Okay, so Betty Jean, this is the moment you've been waiting for. First of yes. all, can you tell us before you opened them, how long did it take for the DNA test to get here for you? I think it was about six weeks. So that was a lot of time for you to be anticipating. Anticipating yeah. it. Yes, it was. Okay, well, we're not going to make you wait any <laughs> longer, so why don't you open them up? Well, hopefully it won't take me six weeks to find the important part on the paper. There's quite a few pages there. Um, I am 65.5% Scandinavian. All right. That is the summary. And going through, it's telling me all my health things here, which is one really cool part of this. I could answer a lot of questions and they will um, use it to help determine which genes correspond with what conditions, things as simple as is your earlobe connected or not, or do you have a uh, propensity to a certain disease. Okay, I'm 100% European. Okay. 99.9% .9 Northwest European, 65.5% Scandinavian, 6.9 British and Irish, 5.3 French and German, 1... .2 Finnish. Okay. So, it sounds like the results are kind of what you thought they would be, correct? No they, surprises? They are. I did slightly wonder if I was going to open it and it was going to say 100% Scandinavian because of what we know. But as I said earlier, what I know of history indicates that all those people who came from Sweden hadn't been there, there and all the way back through time. So it's kind of interesting. So, so now this gives you an opportunity to uh, share this with your family. Um, what, what are the other things that you know, you're going to share with your family about your results? Well, the first pages I passed through includes, um, <clears throat> for instance, I'm predisposed to weigh more than the average. Okay. Which is almost kind of nice. It takes a little stress off of me. <laughs> yeah. There you go. It's there in my go. genes. What can I tell you? Right. Um, but I, um, this I knew. It says I am most likely tolerant of lactose. Scandinavians are. So knowing I was Scandinavian, I figured I was, and I can know I can drink milk. But uh, So things like that share some of those medical types of things. There is a possibility of some serious diseases listed, but a lot of them are going to be things like, am I lactose intolerant sure. or something, which will be almost kind of fun to share. So um, are you going to encourage the rest of your family to participate? I would like to encourage my extended family. Um, my immediate family is not being given a choice. They're each getting a kit for their birthdays <laughs> until I get through all four kids. <laughs> <laughs> so um, they will be doing it. Part of the reason I want to do that is we don't know my husband's family's background and he has been deceased for over 30 years and his you know his parents are long gone and things so i this would be a good way to try to figure out what his background is